We treated a couple of calves for ringworm infection. The important things to remember when you're treating ringworm is first of all, always wear gloves because it is a zoonotic infection and it can be transmitted from calves to other animals, but also very importantly to people as well. Uh, as you can see on these calves, the ringworm lesions tend to be mainly centered around their head and neck. And so when we are treating them, we need to be very careful uh, to make sure that we get right down deep into those lesions. So we're gonna use something like uh, a little scrubby brush just to try and, and penetrate in through that gray scaly crust. Now the actual drug that we use to treat ringworm is a product called Imavrol and it's the only product that's available on the Irish market that's licensed to treat ringworm in calves. It's also licensed to treat ringworm in horses and dogs as well, which are also very commonly affected. Um, and so if you have other animals on the farm, you need to look for signs of ringworm in those animals as well. So when we treated these animals today, we just put them in the, uh, in the crush because they obviously have quite a few deep, um, significant lesions around their head. We soaked the uh, sponge in Imavrol, made up one part Imavrol to 50 parts warm water. So you soak the sponge in Imavrol and you use the sponge then, the abrasive part of the sponge, to scrub the lesions and make sure that the drug penetrates right down through that crust into the spores underneath. The other thing to remember is that there could be lesions developing on the animal in areas that you can't actually see. So when you finish focusing on the lesions themselves, then you can use either a small sprayer like this for smaller calves or possibly a big knapsack sprayer if you have a bunch of calves to do and just spray all over the animals to make sure that you're treating any spores that aren't yet obvious to the naked eye.